I think the most important thing is that refugees are not treated like statistics, that we remember that they're, they're, they're people, their parents and children and partners, their doctors and lawyers and journalists, people with stories just like us. I think people feel it's part of what it is to be British, to offer sanctuary to those who are being persecuted, tortured, su subject to violence, fleeing conflict, fleeing um, famine. Uh, I think we are a tolerant and open-hearted nation. Um, and I feel that you know, the best way to express that is to say to those who are really suffering, if you've got no other option left, we will offer you sanctuary. People think that refugees just take and they deplete the country's resources. But if you were a bit more truthful, a refugee may temporarily take, but in the end, they give much more than they take. Coming home is great. Everybody knows how good it is to go home at, at almost any time. But after you've been gone through something very difficult, and I was able to come home, but refugees can't. Their home's finished. They're dependent on the kindness of strangers, of, on the understanding and sympathy and welcome provided by other societies. Receiving refugees is not a matter of somebody signing papers in some remote office. It's a matter of making friends with new neighbors. It's a matter of turning strangers into a part of the community, and that's done most just by that, treating them normally as part of the fabric of the life of this country, this community.